Hi, this is Sarah Arrow for the 30 day Pinterest challenge. On day one we're going to talk about how to set up your Pinterest account. So first of all make sure you've got an invitation. If you haven't got one email me sarah at sarahcouk and I will email one across to you. So I'm going to go over to now my very full up inbox and I'm going to scroll down and find my Pinterest invite. When I've seen that, at the bottom of it, I click on the invite code here and it will take me over to the site. It also says sign up with Facebook in the big blue box or sign up with Twitter. Um, part of the reason that this is done is it's part of the verification process and people are much less likely to spam or do naughty things with Pinterest if they have to link one of their other social accounts to it. So here we are with my husband's account. Let's give him his own email address. His username. and give him a password. Right. With usernames some people like to use their first names and their surnames as we've done in this instance. Other people like to use words with their key words in and sometimes people prefer to use nicknames. Whatever name you're with you're going to be stuck with for some time. You also have it as part of your domain name over here pinterest.com forward slash Kevin Arrow. So whatever you're with, um, if you want to tell people where to find your pins and where to find your boards, at least have a name that's not something like pinterest.com forward slash hot and foxy in pink or something like that. Yeah, It's something you're going to get embarrassed with saying. So choose something sensible. When you've done that, click create my account. And we're just waiting for it to do what it's supposed to do. And that's it. We're all ready to rock and roll with Pinterest. But before we do, we need to go and do a few other things. So I'll stop the video here and you can read down and see what else you have to do.